Hey guys, um, today is going to be a review on my laptop, and I know I had an old one, but I deleted that because, um, I got a lot of bad reviews on it, well, saying that the video quality was bad, and I completely agree after I rewatched the video, it was horrible video quality. Um, it was really shaky and stuff, but now I have my stand, so everything is going to look nice and good. Okay, um... So first off, as you guys can see, I'm going to try to be a little steady. It's a compact Presario. Um, I'll just go along the top. That right there is a built-in microphone. And so is that. It's a widescreen glossy, a glossy widescreen, sorry. And it's... Um, the Compact Presario F700 series, but the exact one would be the F750 US. Sorry for the glare. Um, now let's go to the cover of it. So we're gonna turn this around. And this USB cord is very short, so. Um, you guys can see I have a sticker on there, and you can see the contact logo right there. Right there. So you can see it's a silver contact logo under it, but this is my life is good sticker. Um, it's the back, it's not a normal back though, it's not a sleek one, it actually has a like, it kind of has texture on it, so you guys can hear. That's what happens when I scratch my nail on that. And then this is what most laptops are like. Listen, much different. So it's not sleek, it has some texture to it. Um, some of the specs, these are all cams for that. Some of the specs are that it um, is a 120 gigabyte, uh, 120 gigabyte hard drive, one gig of memory expandable to three. Um, it has Windows Vista Premium on it, so that's really nice, because I like Vista, even though I don't at the same time. Um, it's 1.9 gigahertz for speed, so I, <coughs> sorry, um, and now let's go on to, I guess, the side features. The really nice thing is that there's nothing in the back, so when I'm at my desk, I don't have to go reach back there and get anything. Hi, kitty. It's all right on the side. So, I'm going to flip my laptop like this, kind of, so I can show you guys. So, on this side, I have um, a S video port right there. I have that so I can hook it up to a monitor or a projector or whatever. Two DSL ports. This might be hard for you guys to see right there. Two USB ports on this side when I have something plugged into. Okay, and my cat's down here. So, cat, you gotta move. I'm making a video. So, I guess basically, let's take it off. Here. Yeah, there's the USB ports. Now to the front, we have the power light, the CD light, like the CD here, and some other kind of light. I'm not sure it's for. And you have the wireless switch right there, so watch, I'm going to turn the internet off. Now when it's orange, that means it's off. Now it's back on. Can't get away from there. You're going to burn yourself. Um, okay, I have to like cat down. He's gonna burn himself on the light. Um, this is my microphone port, so my mic is in there. Headset port. Get out, cat. <laughs> um, uh, it's AMD, as you guys can see. The video G uh, graphics card, Wi Fi certified, Windows Vista, like I said. It has a full size keyboard which is really nice, and the keys are really easy to press. Um, now on to the right side, we have nothing except a CD player, you guys can see it says DVD. Um, and then we have one more USB port, so a total of three USB ports. And then, and there's my cat. And then we have the charging port, and it has a 
neon blue ring around it, which is really nice. Everything on this computer is neon blue. If it's working, that means it's neon blue. If it's orange, it means it's not working. So it's neon blue. It's neon blue. Very very good. And it's neon blue. Um, another really cool feature about this laptop would be the keypad is much bigger than the other computers. Um, I'll do a comparison in size actually. Here's my iPod Nano. It is bigger than my iPod Nano's length. And usually they're like this big. So that's really cool. It's like a max almost. And then height wise. But, um, so it's really easy to operate, except for when you type sometimes, um, your hand will be like this and you might touch it and then it'll move to where your mouse is. So whenever you're typing, you have to make sure that you put your cursor way off to, like, the side of the screen so it doesn't click and you start typing in the wrong spot. Um, it has basic keys, Windows key, and all that. A nice keyboard. That's pretty flat. Um, it has, uh... Affleck Lansing gra uh, speakers up right there and then right there. So they're not the greatest. They usually have JBL, which I really wish they had because that's an amazing speaker. That's actually what kind of speaker that is. But they don't. So, um,. I guess I, I like this laptop. Um, I got it at a really good deal at Circuit City. Or no, not at not Circuit City. At Office Depot. It's really worth it. It's really fast and it's nice. It has a 15.4 inch screen. Let me put my. It has a 15.4 inch screen. It's um. The Compact Presario F75 US, which is made by Howlett Packard. Packard, HP, otherwise. Um, let's see the comp Like, let's see some of my my comments. I have s I have the same laptop. I think your video is the worst one I've ever seen. I have the same laptop. It is awesome. The battery life is only about two hours. I recommend. I highly recommend this to anyone who cannot afford a high quality laptop like a Mac. I'm by by the way. By the way, I'm about to throw up from watching the camera because of how much I moved it. I have the same laptop compact for Shadow Lab 700. It's off it. awesome. I know. Got, I know. I got mine in November. I have the same also. It is great. But the only thing is I wish it had an HP slash compact. I wish HP would improve the speaker. Sometimes mine can be very quiet. And other times it can be very loud. It depends on what you listen to. Also, cat, you're going to burn your head. Also, I wish the battery life would last a little longer. Say you were on the road using MapQuest, something like that. Um, I actually think that the battery life is pretty good for what you get. Um, because uh, I never go on road trips really with my laptop. I will be in summer going camping, but um, then I'll just use it on the charger. So basically, I don't know if the cat's in the way now, but um. I think the battery life is long enough for me for what I use it for. If I ever just need to go in the living room, get, get down! Um, and then, I mean, I have Rocket Dock and stuff, so I guess I'm trying to think of any. It comes with a lot of programs on it, which I deleted a ton of them that came out that I didn't need. Oh, I didn't know that. I forgot to check it. Um, so, like, let's see. It come and the sucky thing it only comes with the trial version of Microsoft Office, not the full version. So you have to buy the full version, which is so gay. But whatever. I mean, I mean, I just use Google Documents. It's fine. I clicked the wrong thing. Um, let's see what else I can't think of. It comes with a ton of games, which take up a ton of memory, so if you get this laptop, you might want to delete them if you need memory and stuff. That's what I did. I cleared... I, like... I got my computer, and, like, ten days later, I just cleared it out. Um... Not completely, but, like, what I never used. So, basically, that's my review on the Compact Pusario F7... U F750 US. Great laptop. I recommend it to anyone, whether you guys... 
Okay, if you have any questions, you can email me or you can contact me at techtalker24.gmail.com or you can send me a message over YouTube. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.